Hello friends, this is Saurav from Blogsage.com. Today we are going to do the review of Leo Privacy Guard Lock and Boost application, which is one of the essential application for your Android handset, which help you to maintain the privacy of your different applications which are installed at your Android device. So I I am going to show you how this application is very different than the available applications which help you to protect your privacy this application is basically built to enhance the experience user experience with uh, very simple steps you don't need to do the complex steps and in very intelligent way so I, I already installed this application on my handset so I'm going to open this application and show you the features and how to use Now at initial state you have to set a password. Now it's asking for the confirm my pattern. I did that. Now it's asking me for the security question. If I forgot my pattern, this will help me to get back. I'm putting my security questions and answer over here. Now you can see the dashboard of this application. In dashboard there are three tabs the lock tab protection tab and my apps tab first I will introduce you about the lock tab this uh, lock tab is having a different modes guest mode home mode and the customized mode which you can create easily now let's move to the app lock here you will find a different application installed in your devices to lock this handset this to lock this application on this handset you just have to click over there there will be a tick mark and just click on the lock now you will see the lock successful message finished okay before moving forward we need a administrative access the app uses access as it is dealing with the security part so I just granted this aspects. Okay, so my all the apps which is having a existing lock, it is showing a lock icon over there, as you can see. Now you will see in the guest mode, 12 applications is already locked. So I will show you after locking how my application will look like if somebody go to your application it will now I have to send you the appropriate pattern which I set it already same with the other application which I set see at the gallery also if I want to hide the pattern I just click over here and click on the invisible pattern now my pattern is not going to show to anyone this is good option over here now let's move to the application itself as you know that as we move to the main application so again I have to put a pattern lock now as I explain you the app lock option now let's move to the theme in theme option you will find the various themes available for the pattern lock there are the online themes as well as the local themes I already have a Tulip theme installed so I just click it apply now my lock screen will be changed with the theme with the Tulip theme which, which I just put it this is just for the UI and UX perspective now let's move to the modes okay these are the modes as I explained you earlier guest mode home mode and the customized mode if you want to add something and in modes option there is a time lock and the position lock tab is there the time lock is one of the essential feature 
in the modes so that you can switch to the different profiles the modes according to the timeline means in the morning I want a home mode in the afternoon I want some different mode such kind of things can be happen okay you can set it accordingly in the position itself in position lock you can put a position of the Wi-Fi if you are switching from the one network to another network that time a particular profile will get activated right so here you have to say that at if I am at a home and I am on the this Wi-Fi the home mode will get activated enable the home mode at Wi-Fi so this help you to protect your privacy when you switch from the one network to another network this is promising feature I can say to protect your data while moving across the different networks now let's move to the app cover as I told you this application is designed in a such a way that it's having a, a different pattern lock systems and a different security settings which help you to deal more rigorously so I will show you the what is that app cover app cover is nothing but a various uh, different standard defined by Leo that you can use during your settings now let's move to the app cover in app cover there are five options no cover beauty cover error unknown caller and fingerprints so I will show you how it is going to use and useful for the people to fool you that uh, the application will get crash and all such kind of things but it will protect you so that they will not access your application rigorously so no cover is already selected which is by default one now let's move to the beauty cover over here it will add another layer in front of your pattern lock which I already defined now I will show you how it will look like now here only I know that how to unlock this zip which is already in the cover so to do that I just do this gesture now a touch, touch gesture is done from my side now the pattern lock screen come out over there now I can unlock similar thing can be happen now there is an error I just set it as an error this is an interesting and one of the innovative a lock pattern designed by this application uh, it will show you uh, how this application will get crash if someone trying to open that application but actually it is not crash it is just a message to fool them that the application get crash so to do that I am enabling this now my error mode is enabled I will go and I will show you okay now you can see there is a message sorry album has stopped but actually it's not if someone click on the close they will get back to the home screen now I again open this album app so to get access to this application I just only swipe from the left to right and it will ask for the password okay and now my screen is unlocked okay now let's move to the application again now I'm going to try with the unknown caller app cover here if somebody try to open a log application they will get this over it will fool them that somebody is calling you right so I'm just enabling it now it's unable now let's go to the album application I'm opening the album 
now you can see my phone is also vibrating so if I did this it will go back to the home screen but I only know that how to unlock so I will just doing this and that this triangle is there now my common pattern will come up and I will unlock it's a dual layer protection defined in the app cover option of this application Leo privacy guard is giving this promising feature which is not present in the existing privacy protection application at app store now the finger pit option is there here you don't need to give the any fingerprints or something it is just uh, uh, you can say full the person who is trying to use your application though your ipo or android handset is having a fingerprint recognition this is not going to deal with any part of that so what it's showing that tap three times with one second to unlock so i have to tap three times within the one second to unlock i just enable it now same thing will happen if I go to the album I just navigate to the album and the pop up screen come up with the fingerprints the person who is trying to access he just put hold his uh, finger over there but he is not able to get an access over here right but only I know that how to get it if I tap it over three times then it will now I am able to access my container this is all about the app cover okay now let's move to the the next tab which is a protection tab this is one of the good option provided by the leo's application protector this will help you to protect your images your videos private SMS and private calls if you want to hide the your images videos SMS and private calls from the strangers or the person who is going to use your mobile you can use this option right now I am not setting anything for my application that's why it's showing me the dangerous warning it will show you you can just go to the hide image option to hide your image you can add it from the gallery itself now let's go to the hide video option same thing you have to do you have to add you have to add a video from the gallery itself and for the private sms also you have to go directly you can do this for the private call also you can set this functionality you can hide all the private calls that you don't need to show in the log option the private sms everything will be hidden from the your inbuilt application so this is a good feature to hide a data from the whatsapp which is getting automatically downloaded if you are using the wi-fi and all so it will save a lot of things it will keep your privacy now let's move to the another tab my apps my apps tab is basically built to manage and enhance the user experience about managing the in installed app in the android so now let's look for the backup and recovery option in backup option you can backup existing application which you already install on your android device so that you can utilize it for the later uses you can take a backup you will find the list of the application you install over here so you just need to select an application you want to take a backup and click over here if you click over here there is a select all option you can backup all the applications also and there is a restore option also so it's very easy to use application to take a backup of your existing application now let's move to the data uses this is an enhanced data manager 
created by Leo team it is giving you the uh, more rigorous and enhanced version of a, a data management in the Android handset you can set a data plan over here then you will see the analytics in the graph format how much data is consumed and how much data you have to utilize there are few options like access alarm you can set an alarm also monthly uses how, how much uh, uses you want to do at a monthly basis so that it will alarm accordingly settlement date amazing features I can say useful if you are using the very costly data plans and you want to save on your data you will see the app list option over here uh, you will find the applications a uh, different applications and their consumption of the internet and the data currently I am not having a I am not uses, used any application from the installing of this app so it's showing the empty here you will find a list of the application who and how many uh, kilobytes or megabytes data used by that application so you can control the uses shortcuts this is a gesture related shortcuts okay now here is an application management option is there where you can easily uninstall any install application directly from this part if I click over here it will uninstall okay basically this is one of the good application by Leo for Android which will help you to manage your privacy in very powerful manner with more innovative manner so that nobody can break your privacy and nobody can steal your data so let's move to the main screen over here there are few settings I want to show you just go to the setting there are multiple options you can find out over here the advanced protection this this feature is one of the promising feature if you activated this feature you, only the administrative person can uninstall this application so no other malicious program can uninstall your application which will protect your data there are the other options like reminder of one new apps once you install a new application it will ask whether you have to set a password or not then unlock to boost invisible pattern is already long unlock to boost is a, a memory boosting application you will see that uh, it will clear my memory I will show you if I click on the boost you can see it will feed up the memory ultimately the final verdict I definitely recommended this application to all the Android users who are very cautious about their privacy and security this is a good application available in the market with a free of cost you can there are no uh, hidden charges or something like that you can just get this application at the play store by just going to and searching for the leo privacy guard lock and boost i hope you like this video please do subscribe to our youtube channel and hope to see this enhanced application on all your android handset thank you this is Saurav signing off have a good day